everybody, just wanted to give you a quick update on um, why I didn't film the uh, originals last two episodes. When I filmed um, episode 11, I took my phone out of the case, in case you don't know I film with my phone, uh, and it, it, it didn't feel right when I took it out, and I looked and the back was coming off, and then what we realized was the battery had swelled up. So I had to send it off to get fixed. It took two weeks to get fixed. I missed um, getting to film those two episodes, which I'm sorry about that. And then after I got my phone back, I decided not to film them. So I got it back, as you can tell. And mm, I don't know what I'm going to do next since I decided not to film them. Uh... I know I'm going to do The Walking Dead Season 8 trailer when it comes out. And I thought about doing Game of Thrones, but I'm not a huge... I like Game of Thrones, but some storylines just don't interest me. And I don't want to have to pretend to be for... Like, I don't want to look like I'm forcing it to be like, Yay, I love Arya. I don't. When I don't. And I just, I'm not crazy about her storyline. And I'm probably going to get a lot of crap from the GTO fans who love her. But, yeah. That's... That's why I'd, I don't know if I want to do Game of Thrones. If you want to see me do Game of Thrones, let me know. Even though I'm a huge fan of Arya. <laughs> uh, but I thought, besides telling an update about my phone, I thought I would do a short review. Since I just finished watching uh, episode 13, the season finale of the originals. And oh my god, that is like the saddest episode. But at the same time, there's happiness at, at the end. But, oh my god, like seeing the best relationship, aka Elijah and Haley, get torn apart was the saddest thing I've seen. Like, oh my god, like they were the strongest relationship. Sure, they had their faults, but oh my god, to see them torn apart that was so hard. Now, the strongest relationship at the moment is uh, Freya and Keelan, which that's pretty good. But oh my god, I should have known at the end Haley would go to Mystic Falls to uh caroline school with alaric and stuff like i should have known that <laughs> but at the same time you know it's very sad that they all have to be separated but at the same time they got they're happy you know i mean rebecca's with marcel finally Haley's with her with hope klaus i don't know what the hell's going on with him he's just roaming the world and elijah elijah oh I never thought he would have Vincent do the magic and then have Marcel compel him. I never thought he'd do it. It was something I never just... It, it just didn't seem like something he would do. But apparently, he did. And I don't know how I feel about that. I, d I don't know how to feel about it. And, I mean, Frey is happy and Cole gets to be happy. I mean, yeah, I get it. Cole's... I liked Cole. I still kind of like him, but I'm I'm on the fence with it after what he did on uh, on almost sacrificing hope to save Davina. Like I'm just not thrilled with him about it. But yeah, it is what it is. But I don't know what they're gonna do for season five. What are you gonna do? I mean, are they, how are they all gonna be back together? Are they gonna bring them back together? Or are they just gonna do? Like, one episode for, like, say, like, Rebecca. And then the next episode's Freya. And then, well, Freya can do, can go anywhere, really. I mean, she didn't get the Inadu's spirit, bones, whatever, in her. So she can do what she wants. I don't know. I'm just, it's so sad. So freaking sad. And then to have Klaus say to Elijah, hey, if I'm going crazy and going down a dark path, let me go. Just let it happen. So sad. So, yeah. I don't know. If you like these kind of review things, let me know. So, yeah. See you next time. Bye.